Hi Aquarius! Welcome to my channel! Okay, you guys made an appearance in the Capricorn, okay? So, I'm not sure where you guys are because the sun is in your zodiac in Vedic Sidereal, which is Aqua placement, not BuzzFeed Astrology. If you have a Virgo placement, we had made a made mistake, a made mistake. We forgot to put the link to the extended. It's up already, okay? But this is for Aqua. I know. Okay. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. Let's begin. And the girl is back. Aqua, the girl is back. Okay. Here we go. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. There we go. Oh, Wheel of Fortune again. There we go. Things are really, really, really good today. <laughs> okay, here we go. Aqua. There we go. There we go. Ace of Wands. Okay, a spark. It's a spark. If there's smoke, there's flame. Oh, that's good. Okay. If there's smoke, there's a fire sign. Or a, is this a person now who's gonna be in Gandanta? Meaning it's a Scorpio Sag or a Aries. A Pisces. A Aries. No. No. Cat Leo Cancer. Cancer Leo. There. Cancer Leo. Okay. Because water fire. Okay. There. Water fire. Can be Cancer Leo. Nah, no. That's Scorpio Sag. Yeah. That is. And Cancer Leo. Okay. Makes sense. So that can be the placement of this person. So last degrees. Okay. I can't remember the... Oh. Last degrees of Scorpios is... No. I, I forgot what the last degrees of uh, Scorpio. Um, Anuradha. Mm-hmm. Anuradha, and then for Cancer Leo is Ashleisha. Okay. So Anuradha. That speaks a lot. Okay. But I'm not familiar with Anuradha. <laughs> Ashleisha, I can talk a lot, but I don't want to be biased. Okay. So I'm not going to talk about both Nakshatra. Okay. But definitely, so when you meet someone, here, I can explain this. Who in, in this particular point of because we look at it in a mundane as the gandanta, the shift from the element, okay? From water element to fire element. Weather, storms, earthquakes, um, with the mundane. So when you meet someone with this nakshatra, so think of it like you're meeting an earthquake, a tsunami, a life-changing person with this nakshatra, okay? So that's the energy that they bring to your life. That's why Ace of Wands is a dynamite <laughs> okay <laughs> boom aqua so you met someone who's life-changing that's how i read i know <laughs> and that's just <laughs> that's one card so do be watchful of the webinar here we go <laughs> insert capricorn <laughs> empress card there you go taurus libra kaboom what else is kaboom? If you got Mojo Jojo, a baby. Unprotected intimate connection equals baby. You don't need to be a reader for that one. Okay? You just have to go to your gynecologist or your OBGYN or the the public health. Okay? Better get yourself checked up. Now you're scared. Okay. I'm scared. It's a baby. It's a blessing. It's a blessing that comes with responsibility. <laughs> it's cute. As long as it's not mine. 
Okay. <laughs> Empress card over here. They love you. Passionate. Good looking. Amazing person here, of course. Empress is... Um, if you feel that Emperor does the right thing, the Empress knows not to do anything. Because it's the right thing. The right thing for me to do is not to be involved. And then just let this thing happen. Okay. So that's good. Empress energy here. Empress doesn't come out, but it's out. It's almost like the girl deck. It's out. <laughs> Insert Capricorn. <laughs> Next to the Ace of Wands. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. It's not good, Aqua. Because this becomes fishy. Get a Seven of Swords. Who is not telling the truth? Dun 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 dun. Because Empress can be a mistress. Dun 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 dun. I'm not an aqua today then. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. But we'll find out because of course we know Seven of Swords is dying betray. But with this deck, okay, just to be fair, this is a person who doesn't want to make a decision that becomes a self-sabotage. The two swords up there is their choice. The five swords down here, it's like they'd rather make an argument about it. So someone is being unreasonable. Alright? Unreasonable. Two swords. This is when it's like they rather fight about it than tell you the truth. So again, it is lying. Yes. So they don't want to fight. I mean, they don't want to tell you something. They'd rather put up a fight. Okay. Let's see here. Let's see. Nine of Wands. So you go on the defense now. Whoever this person is. Nine of Wands says, I'm going to be defensive about who I am, what I am. With the Empress. I can't allow you if you're just gonna be, um, if you're not gonna reveal everything. Let's see here. On uh, the Ace of Wands with the Seven of Swords. Oh, that's what it is. They'd rather fight for your attention than beg for your attention. Someone here is a high horse. Because Eight of Cups is begging. They're not gonna beg you. They will just, you know, this is where, this is becomes toxic, you know why? Because this is when they can't express their heart fully, it becomes an aggression rather than, you know, expressing it clearly. Yeah, I heard about that one also, yeah. Like, stop with the mind games! <laughs> Someone's creating drama. This is drama. It's not even a big lie. That's what they say. Okay, whatever. Nine of Wands with Ember's <laughs> Ten of Cups, you see? Love is there, it's clear, it's good. And someone just has to stir the pot. Let me stir the pot. Let me, because without stirring the pot, I don't feel that there is love. <laughs> they like they like the passion. It's totally Scorpio Sage and Adida Gandanta. Totally also Cancer Leo, totally Ashlesha. Mm -hmm. Let me stir the pot. <laughs> so I can feel the love. Stir the pot it is. <laughs> okay. There you go. Ten of Cups. Okay. Again, for others, it is a lie. Yes. Okay. <laughs> now, let me see here what the girl is saying as we stir the pot. Here we go. Okay. Here comes the girl. Retreat and recover. So just in case this becomes toxic because of this stirring the pot to get you out of your shell to open up so that you will express your love or vice versa whoever wants to stir the pot they're doing it successfully instead of them speaking out their heart clearly um, they won't because they like the passion when you guys have this tension okay I feel that this is a very tension card eight of cups with the seven of swords they like the tension to keep happening so that the love keeps you know you know, like getting that steam, getting it out there. Okay? So this is that kind of uh, energy with the Ten of Cups. So we'll see as it's, um, you know, you got, you got a stirrer, okay? And you got the cups, Ten of Cups. You got the love. Someone just likes to keep stirring it with the Ace of Wands to make sure that everything is basically... Um, to just so that they feel that there's still love in the connection, there's passion. This is a person who's like, I want you to fight for me kind of energy. But they're nobody's victim. Nobody nobody has to be fighting. Okay. <laughs> Everybody should just be loving. Alrighty. So I'm gonna continue this reading. Link down there in the description up for the extended read. Also for the girl deck. I'll see you guys again. And also the Mercury bundle is out. Alrighty? Thank you very much, guys. Bye.